putting a story that's ignited the interest of the British media under our microscope. Vedika Bahel joins us for Truth or Fake. Vedika, good evening. The Princess of Wales has admitted doctoring an official family photo. Tell us more about what's caused the controversy. Yes, Mark, this is the first official photo of the Princess of Wales since her abdominal surgery in January, as speculation surrounding her condition has continued to soar. Now, whilst it was Prince William who took the photo, uh, the family photo, uh, it was the Princess of Wales herself who has claimed responsibility for editing it, saying that it was an occasional uh, experiment for her. Now, it was uh, the video, the, 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 the photo was cut by uh, five news agencies around the world. They put out something called a kill notification or a kill order just hours after it was shared uh, over concerns that it had been manipulated. So what are some of these inconsistencies that we've observed in this image? Well, I think the first and the most glaring there is Princess Charlotte's uh, sleeve. If we have a closer look here, we can see that a huge portion of her cuff is missing whilst the the sleeve wraps around her wrist here. There isn't anything to support it. Uh, so it is fading off into nothingness. Over here, we've also got some doubt raised about the fact that the wall behind Prince Louis isn't straight. There's a curve in the middle of it, uh, as well as the fact that his arm, whilst in perfect vision and, and clear, his mother's uh, hand right behind him is actually out of focus and blurry as well. Uh, Kate's also not wearing her wedding ring that she's rarely seen uh, without. That also raised some out eyebrows. Uh, and there's also been some doubt cast about the way that Princess Charlotte's skirt is sitting on her body uh, and the way that the, her, her hair is falling over her shoulder. Now, the last element here that people have raised question on is the reflection or the lack of reflection rather in the background. Whilst we can see behind the, ch the Prince Louis there into the room, we can see through the window, we can see furniture there in the background. There isn't any reflection visible uh, of the children's heads, Mark. Indeed, as you say, five of the world's biggest news agencies actually pulled the photo. So tell us, Vedika, what does this mean for the reputation of the British royal family? Well, this photo uh, was meant to put an end to months of wild speculation and rumours uh, surrounding Kate's health, but it's inadvertently ended up doing the opposite. It's actually ended up raising more questions and fueling more conspiracy theories uh, about the topic. Now, news agencies have very, very strict guidelines about the, the, the photographs uh, and the sourcing that they put out, uh, even to the extent where the removal of red eye from photographs is not allowed. Everything has to be disclosed in advance, any alteration. Um, and when we look at the uh, analysis of the metadata of this photo, uh, it's clear here that there is uh, the image was taken on a Canon digital camera lens. It was also saved twice, uh, we can see here, from uh, in Adobe Photoshop on an Apple Mac computer. So this is embarrassing for the royal family uh, that it has come out, that it has been manipulated, um, particularly as it casts some doubt over the veracity of the images that they've put out bef uh, before in the past, but also the ones that they may put out uh, later in the future. But here's what the director of photography at news agency AFP had to say uh, about this topic. Major communication failure from their side to distribute such an image, which raises doubts, will only create rumors and, and, and make us doubt that she's as well as they want uh, her to look. We have a duty of transparency, we have a duty of trust towards our subscribers, towards uh, they are viewers and we have to kill the picture. It's uh, absolutely a red line that was crossed there in terms of journalism. And finally, Mark, despite calls to uh, quell the rumours and, un and, and release the unedited version of this image, the raw version of this image, Kensington Palace has declined. They've said that they would not be reissuing uh, the original photo. Indeed. Still leaves the question, doesn't it? Where's that wedding ring? It's a thing that I'm kind of intrigued by. Vedika, thank you very much indeed for that explanation. Really